If you've just recently replaced an ink cartridge and the printed pages are coming out either entirely blank or with some blank gaps or missing some text, you'll number one want to make sure you've removed the protective shipping tape or the vent tape from the ink cartridge. Uh, this is easily overlooked, but it's really simple to fix. On HP, Lexmark, Dell, and other similar print head cartridges, you'll find a strip of plastic film along the bottom of the cartridge covering the print head. This tape's used to seal and protect the print head during shipping, but obviously you want to take that off in order to print. It prevents ink from entering the print head where it dries to form an ink clog. Don't confuse shipping tape with the control ribbon. The red-brown film that contains the circuitry used to operate the cartridge could be mistaken for shipping tape. Don't remove that. It will basically make your cartridge useless. On Epson Canon and Brother ink cartridges, or for fixed print head inkjet printers, you'll see a tear-off strip, usually with a graphic that says this is to be pulled off. The tear-off strip seals the vent holes on top of the cartridge to prevent it from drying out on the shelf or during shipping. After making sure that the shipping tape has been removed, run the printer's head cleaning utility to prime the cartridge, then print the test page. If your printed output still indicates clogged ink nozzles, from inside a software application such as Word or Notepad, go to the File menu and click Print. Click on your printer in the list to select it, and then click on Preferences, and then Utilities or Maintenance tab. Locate and run the head cleaning utility at least once, but never more than three times in a row. Print a test page.